And let's try and do this Sephora haul one more time. I filmed it twice now and then when I hit stop, it's like you see the line go like this and it just deletes everything. I'm like, what is going on? But I finally had like a couple minutes, so I want to go through everything that I got. So let's just start. I have not really heard people talking about this, and I don't know why, because I just happen to be in store, and I'm like, I'm a little bit bored with like the selection at Sephora. Let me just try some different things. And I saw this, and I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot they came out with a vanilla one. I liked the peach one, but when I smelled this, I was like, what? This is rich decadent there's like cherry in here vanilla there has to be like i feel like some caramel or something it's like are the notes on here no it just says addictive risque and sinful but the bottle is like so pretty too i really like that they're glass it just makes it feel a little bit nicer than like you know a body mist that usually comes in a plastic container very pretty big and it lasts really well especially like on my clothes so highly recommend smelling this one the next time you're in sephora next i got another one of the blush filters from huda this is one of the new shades in the icy collection and it's called coco loco it looks like a really pretty kind of bronzer blush kind of shade so i'm really excited to use that then i finally got a full size of the armani eye tint this shade is just i had two minis of them that i got with like points i got one i went back to the store got another one and then i'm like okay it's time to get the full size it's just oh it's so pretty and i really like these because they last well on my eyelids like even if you have oily eyelids hooded eyes whatever once it dries down, it stays really well. I'm like, look at how gorgeous that is. I wanted something that I could do like on top of shadows by itself and it would still be pretty. And like, I mean, that's it by itself and it's gorgeous. Then this is the Styx Party Mix from Milk. If you don't know already, me and Milk are like, I love them. They were probably one of the first brands that really got me like into beauty products like a long long time ago so this little set was just calling my name so it comes with two of their lip and cheek sticks in work which is a dusty rose that I already love and rally I like too so I'm like okay I already know that I love those two and then there is a highlighter shade which is like limited to this set and I just want to show you that one because it's so pretty. Wait, is it? Of course, it's the one that I don't get out. Oh, wait, no. This is work. Where is it? Okay, here it is. What's the shade called? Oh, rad. Oh, this whole time I was reading it as a red, pink, pearl highlight. But it's rad. A pink, pearl highlighter. Let's do it right here. Look at how pretty. That would even be pretty on the eyes. I feel like for New Year's, Christmas, whatever, the holidays, that's going to be so cute. Definitely will be using that. Then I got my first Makeup by Mario brush. I don't know how I've gone this long without one, but I've heard great things. So I got the F1, which has the smaller side and the bigger side, because there's a brush that I have by... I can't get to it right now, but by CL, who makes really awesome brushes. And it's kind of like that with a smaller side and then a bigger side. And I use it all the time for everything. So definitely excited for that. Then we got the Rare Beauty Brow Harmony Gel Lifting. What is it? Why is it in French? Oh, Flexible. <laughs> Flexible Lifting Gel. I've heard people say good things about this. I use usually the Make Beauty one or the Patrick Ta one. So we'll be testing that out. This, I was so excited to see this back in stock. So this was like my ride or die bronzer for a long time. And I actually went all the way through the cream. So 
I went to go get another one and it was sold out in this shade on Sephora on the Patrick Ta site and I was like what is going on I am so sorry my glasses are fogging up because I'm always hot and sweating uh so this is she's oh she's sculpted and oh she's gorgeous I'm so excited to have that back in my routine then we have two summer Fridays balms I bought the iced coffee and the hot cocoa because last Christmas I had the red and the pink and I let my son's girlfriend pick whatever one she wanted so I think we're gonna do the same thing with these ones I feel like she'll I don't know which one she might want but she's like the sweetest thing ever and she's like the daughter that I never had you know what I mean then we have I have seen so many of my favorite like beauty influencers using these and saying how amazing they are their skin looks amazing when they use it like still looks like skin but just like flawless like a filter was put on so I picked them up we got the Dior um multi-use foundation stick blur correction 24-hour wear and hydration in 1n neutral and then we got shade one in the sculpting face stick. Let me just like show you the packaging because I love it. And look at this shade. It looks perfect. This is like the kind of thing where I'm like, oh, it's going to take me a second to use it because it just looks too perfect. Like I'm like, I don't even want to touch it. Um. Okay, hold on. I got to go get the box now okay this next thing i'm gonna do a little giveaway probably just like i'll do friends only so if you're not following maybe you should um because i bought this in my online order that i did first and then i went in store and for some reason i didn't think that they had it in store but when i saw that they did i have no patience and i was like well i want it now i don't want to wait for it to be shipped so now i have two and it's the Danessa Myricks blush set, which I thought was just, this is too good of a deal, okay? $35, you get two full sizes and two minis. Now I'm like, which one did I open? Okay, this one's still closed. Let me just like show real quick because these shades, if you have not tried these, you need to okay they're like her balm powders but with color so this is spiced latte and then we have the other full size dancing queen oh i'm so excited for that one and then these minis are adorable we have red velvet and jubilee so i will definitely do like maybe a separate video trying them on and then i'll put like whatever for the giveaway in there then we got oh my god let's see if i can fit this we got the fenty skin cookies and clean whipped clay intensive pore scrub I love a physical exfoliant sometimes, so I had to get that. This I've had my eye on from Westman Atelier for quite a while, and so since it was a sale, I'm like, just get it now. This is their bronzer. When I tell you this thing is heavy, like this could be a weapon, but I have swatched this so many times in store, and it is like the softest, most buttery powder bronzer that I've ever felt. Like, I had to have it. And then, ooh, these last two are so good. Then we got the Westman Atelier set because I needed this blush shade. I was like, I have to have it. It's limited edition in the shade Bubble. And then you get Toast in the highlight and a mascara. And then we got this from Farah Homidi. It's her face um, compact. I gotta show you guys this. And that's it. Hope you liked it. Bye.